So this year, my family is going to celebrate Lent, which is a season of remembering Jesus's life and suffering and work on the cross that he did for us um, by remembering the story and by remembering not only the story, but how it also is our story. And the way that we plan on doing that this year is by reading through um, the Jesus Storybook Bible, which is a children's Bible, and my kids are teenagers, but I think this um, Bible does such a fantastic job of showing how every single part of the Bible points to this, to Jesus, to our rescue story. And um, I just wanted to take a minute to read a little excerpt from this book for you because I just think it's so neat. Um, I think you'll like it. The Bible, most of all, is a story. It's an adventure story about a young hero who comes from a far country to win back his lost treasure. It's a love story about a brave prince who leaves his palace, his throne, everything to rescue the one that he loves. It's like the most wonderful of fairy tales that has come true in real life. You see, the best thing about this story is, it's true. There are lots of stories in the Bible, but all the stories are telling one big story. The story of how God loves his children and comes to rescue them. It takes a whole Bible to tell this story. And at the center of the story, there is a baby. Every story in the Bible whispers his name. He is like the missing piece in a puzzle, the piece that makes all the other pieces fit together. And suddenly you can see a beautiful picture. And this is no ordinary baby. This is the child upon whom everything would depend. This is the child who would one day, but wait. Our story starts where all good stories start right at the beginning. So this is the book that we'll use to go through um, the life of Jesus and the Bible and how all the stories point to him. And this is how we will be remembering um, how our story fits into the bigger story of Jesus and his kingdom.